But I was giving thanks for Mankind TV. We're here in Winwood, and we have a special, a special, 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 special guest, Michelle Scriptures. How you doing, sister? I'm doing great. How are you? I want to first thank you you um, for this interview because I know that you don't normally do interviews or even show your face. I get to see the face. (laughs) Don't tell nobody. Don't come looking for me because I won't tell nobody either. I don't know what you look like. Okay, but um. Met you on Instagram, saw your 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 your, um, your love posts, and I was very touched by your love posts. See somebody inspiring love like you do, and one day um, I hear doing my thing, and I look on the floor, and I see the same messages, and I'm like, what what is this? And I take a picture and I tagged you. So why um, why do you feel like you have to inspire love? Why not inspire love? I think that's more the question. Everybody's all ready to, you know, speak about something negative that's happening to them or they're ready to focus on what went wrong in their day instead of being grateful for the things that did go right. They woke up, they're breathing, they're alive, they're Amen. surrounded. They're surrounded by positive things, you know, if they have a roof over their head, if they have food in their breathing. stomach, they're breathing, they're alive. And even if they don't have what they want to have in life, sorry to cut you off. Uh-huh. I like this girl. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> even if they don't have what they want to exactly have in life or they're not where they want to be, but they're alive and they're here right. and they have the ability to become whatever it is they want to be and love is why we are here to begin with yes. you know two people collaborated we're all walking works of art two people collaborated to make us to make you to right. make me love and the love they felt in that moment for one another Ooh. created us Ooh, I never thought of that yeah so why not but spread love born in the image of love born in the image of love yes so I know. walking masterpieces yes. Amen. <laughs> um, so, what started first, the, um, the poetry, or, or I w- what would you call your writing? Is that poem? I do not consider myself a poet. I consider myself a writer. writer to call writer. myself a poet, right, right, it's, right. it's too deep. You know right, what I mean? Right, right, I don't right. think that's I'm that I, good. You know? Um, well, your words are. Thank you. I, I try to be inspiring. I try to inspire love and everything. And I don't just write about the positive. So, things what of love. came I write about first? The would it be the um, the writing, or? Um, the, the the painting first came the writing i've been writing since as long as i can remember since i was a kid i'm a musician oh really generally. oh yes I, um you said you classical i i was since i was four i've been playing the piano and the violin what we got to work <laughs> just know that <laughs> we can so, we can collaborate so the right, so you write music and then you would, came into... It first began well. when I when I was younger, I would write. It was a form of therapy. You know, I would have a bad day, I'd write. If I'd have a good day, I'd write. If I was, you know, inspired by a piece of music I, I was, you know, practicing or I, I wrote myself, I would right. write for it. And then as I got older, the music dimmed out of it, but my writing continued. And it just right. became about my feelings and it became part of the most personal thing that I would ever do. Well, um, this I know for a fact that... You know, when you're spreading love and inspiring love the way you do, something hits you. Like, what hit you that made you feel like you, you, you have to do this? I was. Everybody don't do this. I mean, even if you feel like spreading love and inspiring love, it takes something else to make you go to that level. I felt that the world was a very dark place. It was. I was at a very dark time in my life. You know, I had gone through a bad breakup. I, you know, I... I've gone through a lot of personal things in my life, a lot of adversities, and I kind of, writing it down on paper wasn't doing it anymore for me. And I was like, why can't I use my negatives and the things that have happened to me and I've been able to overcome to help other people? So I I created an Instagram and I began to write and post it. And I started getting feedback and people following me and and young women and even men have written to me and they're like, oh my goodness, you you actually inspire me. Like you you helped me out of this situation. And then, you know, and, and if, I had to go through everything I had to endure and all the negatives to help somebody else. It's worth it. Hey, man, that's beautiful. It's nothing better than helping others out. So when did the Winwood part come in? When did the, the dancers and the spraying and the, when did that part come in? I've always loved art. I've always been into the arts and music and all of that. And then my friends are very, I have a lot of friends that are artists and they're very involved in the art scene here. And, you know, I was like, I started seeing all these messages on the floor and a lot of them were kind of raunchy and right. dirty and not so positive. And I was like... Why not put my poetry right. in the form of, you know, Instead a stencil? Of complaining, yeah. Why not just put the good stuff Put something in. positive. And somebody's having a bad day and they look down and they right. see a positive message and like they're I like, did. bam, like, like you oh, did. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. And then it brightens it. your day. Yes. So, you know, why not create a good reason to look down? Wow. We're, we're, like, we're, we're actually on the same mission. 
that's kind of crazy. So, classical music, and you also said that you're a big fan of hip-hop. I'm a very big fan of hip-hop. Favorite artist? Hip-hop artist? Uh, Tupac? Oh. Nas? Ding, ding. Nas, Ding, Nas, yes. Two points. You get two points for that. Wu-Tang Clan is also famous. Five points. Yeah. I love it. Tupac, Nas, and Wu-Tang. Can't yeah. get no better than that. Jay-Z also. I love Jay-Z. Jay-Z is okay with me. Yeah. It's cool. Kind of he's the modern but day. Nas, you know, but Nas Wu-Tang, is Wu-Tang, Tupac. Yeah. My kind They're of thing. historical. So, Michelle Scriptures. Why Michelle Scriptures? Michelle is my first name. It's my real name. S is the abbreviation of my last name. Oh. Um, so people think it's plural, like Michelle's, like, you know, possessive as in Michelle's scriptures. But it's really Michelle, the, oh. the initial of my first, of, of my last name, sorry. I'm my, my writing name that I use for my art is Michelle Morgan. Oh. I do not disclose my real identity. Of course not. Uh, <laughs> you don't want you to get locked up right here. <laughs> <laughs> not just that, but I... I be free. Yeah, I want to be free, too. <laughs> And um, scriptures is because when I think of love, I think of God. And, Amen. And the word of God is written in the form of scriptures. So if I'm going to write, you know, words of love, why not call it Michelle's scriptures? Oh, man. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So what's been changing your life since you started doing this? Since I've been doing this, everything has become, in my life, my personal life, a lot more positive because I feel like everything I had to go through was for a purpose. Everything has a meaning. We all have purposes of, you know, the universe places us here, whether you believe in God or not, you know, I do, but for those who don't and they create, they believe in other things in the universe or whatnot, you know, everybody has their purpose. And I believe that my purpose is to be here, to be a positive light within my reach, however far it may be, but to be a positive impact on somebody else's life. And if I have to endure negativity in order to spread that positive vibe, then I will. So have you ever done speaking? I have spoken. Yes, because you are you are excellent. I, I have spoken before. Um, I get a little nervous in in front of you know more intimate settings. I have a little bit of a problem because it's all eyes on me kind of thing, you know. But in front of larger crowds, I mean, I'm very outgoing. I'm very outspoken, so I don't have a problem with. So where did that confidence come from? It's born in me. You always been like that. I've always a little, been since confident. a kid. Since I was a kid, I've always been confident. So what's your favorite? Um, writing or playing music? Gotta, gotta pick one, sorry. I can't, I can't pick one. You got one. to, you got to. You can't be with two people at the same time. You gotta pick one. You gotta pick one. Which one do you love the most? Writing. Oh, writing, okay, okay. Writing. Um, Could we have this thing that we do on a show for Mankind TV on universemember.com? It's called These Are My Favorite Things. So that's why I ask you those questions. Yeah. Food. Food. Pizza. 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 Oh. Cheese, pizza, and a Pepsi. Okay. That is my favorite. <laughs> so, guys, when you walk by Michelle's scriptures, leave some pizza and some Pepsi. That's when she comes around. <laughs> so, what's next for, for Michelle's scriptures? Where, 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 is, where do you ex- want this to take you? I want to publish a book. That's my mission, and I'm in the process of writing one, so I'm looking for a publisher that's willing to work with me in, in doing that. Um, I would like to, um, I've worked pri- prior in the past, I've worked with young girls, you know, that have gone through adversities and, you know, abuse, rape, things like that. I would like to do, norm- do more non for profit, help, you know, charities for women, even young kids. I would love to work with something like that. Um, I would also like to do, like, public speaking in reference of, like, spreading positive words and vibes yes. and all of that. Well, I think, I think that's in your future for sure. Yes, and I'm also creating a love project that I'm going to be starting off and basing out of Wynwood with a few other local artists and international artists as well, and um, and some infamous people. And I am going, <laughs> I am going to um, hide the word love throughout different murals that wow. I will be part of and collaborating with other artists and creating across Wynwood. So between now and this year's Art Basel, and the 2015 Art Basel, they'll be up and running. And for Mankind TV, we'll bring you the exclusive. Yes, and yes. you will have one of the first interviews. I promise yes. you this. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm really grateful and thankful, and I want to commend you and applaud you for what you're doing. And no matter what, don't stop. Keep doing it because I we, won't. You, you're born to do this, and this, and, and the world needs this now. So I want to commend you. I want to thank you, thank you. For, for coming on Four Man Con TV. Thank and you. we will bring you the face live and scoop on Four Man Con TV Universe Miami at some point. At some point. Yes. <laughs> We want to get thanks to Michelle Scriptures. And if you're walking in Wynwood, what I ask you to do is this. If you see Michelle Scriptures, Inspired for Love, put your feet down. Come on, let me show you. Walk with me, walk with me, walk with me, walk with me, walk with me. Come, come. So, I want you to put your feet like this and take a picture. And look for Michelle's Scripture on Instagram. That's Michelle with S Scriptures on Instagram. Take a picture and tag her. And, and, and show, show some love and spread some love. Come on back over here real quick. 
So, um, how long have you been coming to Winwood, real quick? I've been coming to Winwood for a few years now. Um, now it's it's very frequent because since I have you know my my messages on the floor and stuff like that, so it's pretty much every weekend. Sometimes during the week I come here because I'm also working on that project that I told you. So right. I'm here quite often, and I do meet every now and then with certain fans that that do write to me and they really like my stuff. I have met with a few people, and you know they they are allowed to see my face, and I sit down and I talk with them. That's and stuff that's like that. that's so beautiful. I do. Once again, I want to thank you for coming for Mankind thank TV, you. and we will be looking forward to being around you and hanging around with you yes, and doing some more things with you and part of being a part of Love Projects. Yes. So you, thank you definitely. I would love to oh, yes. collaborate if oh, you yes. can. Oh, yes. No. To be a part of it. I, 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 I am a part of it. Consider yeah. it done. And we, we're going to catch you. Um, maybe put a little scripture on the floor. Yes. I'm yes, so. for you. All right. For Mankind TV, Universe Miami .com, Bob's Give Thanks. about the scripture that what made you want to do that? Um, What's your yourself? Oh, I'm Lizzie. Right. I'm Shay. And I'm Valentina. Good to meet you. I'm Bob's good thanks. So what about the scripture what, why you wanted to um, take a picture? I just thought it was beautiful and I thought it was beautiful so I took a picture of it. <laughs> what's, what's beautiful about it? The words? What about the words, the words? yeah. The words moved me especially just during this time. I just thought it was beautiful. That's good. One. What about you? Um, I felt that the sayings really appealed to me and I just, I don't know, like <laughs> what were you? Uh, I, well, I think the same thing. I just thought they were cool, and I like how they were written. They caught my attention as I walked by. So. That's beautiful, and that's, that's that's a good thing because uh, she was interviewing her, and that's what she hoped to accomplish. So you guys did actually accomplish her both for her. So that's a beautiful thing. I want to thank you guys for um for the interview for Mankind TV, Universe Miami dot com, and give thanks, Universe Miami. <laughs>